Hello friends, this is Scott, and I've been working on this video for the last three weeks because I want to give you a little bit of a view of the progress of the Egyptian walking onions and how they've uh, come to date. Now this was first videos from April 21st. As you see, there's plenty of growth. The bed has really thickened up exactly how I wanted. You see the new growth of the, that's why I call them walking onions. They fall over and they reroot. And you see the little ones are first year plants. But uh, the stand of onions is very healthy. It's getting taller. I don't see any of them walking yet until May 5th. And then what do we see? We start seeing the top sets starting to form. And here's a couple of the little ones, yearlings. First year, I should say. And then here's the top sets starting to come up the plant. They start low, and then they, they get taller, and then that's when they break open and start doing their medusa. I call it the medusa factor, but... The top sets will break open and shoot out more sets or more runners and then more sets and bulbs will end up on those. Well, not all the leaves have these top sets, uh, but each plant will have a few as they mature. First year plants generally don't have them. Uh, it's usually the second year that you'll start to see the, the shoots coming up. As you see here's a close up. They start very low on the plant and then they just grow to the sun and just get taller and taller. And here's a look at a few more. So they've got a ways to go. Again, this is May 5th, and they're doing great. This view is today, May 16th. As you see, the top sets have come very tall, and the little paper cocoons. Some of them still haven't broken open, but others have started to bro break open. As you see, the new runners will shoot out, and then they'll set... Uh, more bulbs on the end of those runners and sometimes they do it twice they'll shoot more they'll do bulbs and then they'll shoot more sets out of those bulbs and then at the very end of the season you'll have all these tendrils with with little groupings of bulbs that'll as the plant gets old it'll dry up and fall over and then those are the the bulbs clusters that will sit on the ground and reroot themselves and it's funny, you call them walking onions because you think, oh, they're not going to go very far. Well, I've got some that are just right next to this uh, main bed of plants. But then I also have some that have moved um, literally 10, 15 feet away. Whether I kicked them, whether they, you know, I don't know how I raked them up and they got moved, but that's kind of how they go through the, through the garden. So here's a little few final close-ups of where they're at right now. And, and I'll do a further update later in the fall as soon as the bulbs... Uh, get produced. But thanks for watching this video. And if you like what you see, please check out my other videos and subscribe to my channel as I need some subscribers. Got lots of views. My channel's growing, but I could definitely use some more subscribers. So thank you for your support and have a great day.